so hey guys today in this video we are going to see that how can you uh, send emails via flask mail which is a python based uh, module so let's move in our vs code here we will create some files and folders uh, our first folder will be templates folder and a static folder and a file named as app.py let's move this uh, file out of this folder and place in main directory okay and we will need a configuration file here too which will be .v dot env so in this file we will load all our credentials which will be served in our flask app so you will be needing a template uh, you will be needing the module firstly so type in terminal pip install flask hyphen mail as I have already installed this so this is showing requirement already satisfied close this terminal firstly we will be needing a HTML template from which uh, we can receive our data which we want to be sent so uh, we will be creating a index.html This is the default code for our index page and I will title uh, this page as send email. Okay. So now in body section we will need a form out there. Form ended section will be slash submit. Method will be post. And this will and this will contain some input fields. Okay, so instead of this, we will use name. Label for name. Type will be text. Name will be um, name. ID will be name. This is fine. This is all for this is also fine. Okay. And there will be a button uh, for submitting all this data. Let's check our form. Okay. This is used for resizing this. We can actually remove this or we want. If, or if we want we can keep this but I am removing this and reload this okay now it's fine now let's move in our app.py and uh, firstly we can create our virtual environment out there Python create environment VNV this will create our virtual environment our virtual environment is being created now till then this let's wait for a few seconds okay so our virtual environment is created now firstly we can check for flask installation from flask import flask then for from flask mail mail import mail and message this is not hyphen this is basically underscore mail and message so we will import os here too because we will be using python.env package
python input dot in okay now we will load this just a second then we will name our app that is the basic thing now we will have to do one thing mail app just a second this is not actually you have to type this this capital M and let's assign this to a variable named as mail okay now we will configure our app we will be using SMTP server of Gmail then uh, our mail port uh, will be 465 let's close this terminal we will uh, we will get our username that is mail username or you can see your gmail account from our environment variables this is our environment file and we will also get this password from environment variable then we will actually use tls true okay sl we will also use this and set this to true We have already typed this command, so we will not type this again. Now we will create our routes at app.route. This will not be our index route. Our index route will just return. Okay, let me show you return. This will return our index template index.html return render template we have to import this render template index.html okay then we will create a new route and this will be our submit route which we have created in our HTML document. End method will be post def submit. If method double equal to post, then what this will do is this will request name from our HTML form. Email, we have not included email there. We actually have subject there. Okay, subject request dot form subject. then message then this will be configured okay and we are and here we have to type our recipient address our recipient will be we will also load this from our environment variable so we will be needing some things this will be our recipient email rec underscore mail and this will be our sender mail sender mail or you can say uh, kind of delivery mail delivery mail our messages will be delivered from this mail and received at this mail okay then what we have to do is okay and this will also be our delivery mail okay then hello and this message body will be this the, uh, they will type hello and the name will be fetched from this variable and then our message okay and what this will do is this will basically send our message in a combined format so if we want our subject to be here then we will remove this hello and type subject subject okay and then I guess this is all set this is hello from 
this is hello from uh, when someone will enter their name and send a message then then our recipient will get this hello from that person and it and his message okay and after that what uh, what he will face at user interface the person that is sending the message he will get again redirected to the index function url of index let's proceed further okay so now let's test our app app dot run debug equal true okay before that i need to load uh, these two environment variables which will be these mail username sorry 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 this delivery email I will assign this value with equal and then end it with a comma and then password and one more thing that is recipient email that's it these are the all things which we need okay i will tell you one more thing let me log in into my browser so so what you have to do is open your uh, email account which you want as a delivery mail then uh, turn your two step verification on after that search for app passwords Yeah, you have to create your app password which will be used in your VS code for that let's name this app as VS code VS code mail app and when you hit uh, create button then you will get a 16 digit code which will be your password you have to directly uh, paste that in your env file Okay, I'm uh, pausing the video and uh, creating that password. So I have got my 16 digit password and I will paste it here in string values and also email in string values and recipient email also in string values. Okay, let me do this. Till then I will pausing the video. Okay, so I have pasted one my configuration in the env file now let's run our app now let's run our app let's follow this link uh, the name is Pratham and subject will be ABC messages hello send ok just a second I think this is the issue because we have set our TLS our TLS to true we have to set it false because if we are using 465 port we have to uh, set TLS to false and SSL to true. Now let's rerun and reload this page. Continue. We are getting the same error. Let's check what's the error. So, so guys, I have got the error. Now what you have to do is just come back in your app and place this command that is mail uh, mail equal to mail app just below our app configuration and you can even try changing your port that will be 587 and then uh, SSL will be set to false okay uh, then save this program and run your 
by then by and now if you try sending a mail this will uh, this will be sent now let's type caption as uh, search subject as new mail from now let's type uh, this name as Rohan new mail from Rohan message will be hello how are you so I will just hit send button now you can see this uh, loading button and our mail is sent I will show you in my uh, inbox just a second so this is a this is the mail which I have received from my another gmail account now uh, we can just decorate our some now we can just decorate our HTML page that is this page with some CSS too. So guys that's all for this video. Now let's see next time.